Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to my Thai Dominion or Zheng Jiang playthrough where we are at peace for a change, though I, though Wei is probably about to die. Um, how are we? Let's have a quick look at our diplomacy. So Wei is still friendly with us. Lee, oh they're beginning to like us. And they like us. Um, I would like... And I could potentially support their independence. And their independence, which would be good for me. Will anybody confederate with us at the moment? Unfortunately not. What do you want? Yeah. Oh, no, actually, we are making slightly more there. Um... But not enough to make it really worthwhile. Uh, they, they currently hate me, so... yeah. No, I'm not going to do that just yet. We'll, we'll see what people offer me over the next few turns, because all of those will get better. We do need to rejig my forces' positions slightly. I'm happy here uh, with the positioning over here. One of you guys. I oh, know we've got an army down here. You can you can stay down here. Vent frustration. Get moving. March. Forward. Point as one. The path is clear. There we go. Uh, cross one on the river. They're all just going to go to various places. Some of them do still need building up, which I am aware of, guys. But at the same time, we've got other stuff we need to do. In fact, this army. For China. How may I serve, my lord? Oh, we've got a son. I forgot about that. I answer, my lord. Is going to be recalled for the time being, because having the armies in the fields, I can always get them back up as needed. Um, having them in the field actually costs us lots of money, so we may look at dropping some of our armies as we after we've rejigged them, just to up our income, guys. Um, I know you can come down here. You My soldiers need can head here. I could take them, but I'm not that fussed at the moment. You you're quite a nice army. I said these are all quite nice armies. Um These guys are gonna get disbanded as well for now. Caution! Daus is the heart's desire. Which will really push out my income, which means I can start working on... Because while we're at peace, we may as well work on buildings. No better armour for him. Let's have a look. Uh... Where do I want to go? Um... Increased chance of capturing damage rate of walls during siege is increased. Okay, yeah. There we go. Hmm. We'll go for that simply so we can get that. You are about to leave us. Desires a higher position in court. Feng you. I know I've probably said that horrifically, guys. Oh, God damn it! One day I'll click on the right thing. Hmm. I don't really have a position I can put him in, so he's just going to have to bloody well cope. Mm. 
what are we trying to build here in Bohai? This is definitely a food producing settlement. Uh, does increase, increase our reserve long run. And reserves are good for certain, well, in certain places. Um, but upping my income is also good. To build a tax building, <laughs> get income from my peasants, but also make them unhappy. I'm not a huge fan of them. A straight extra hundred income from tax. From commerce. Can't afford the inn, so we're going to go for private workshops. And we're going to enter. Because we're skipped. Okay, I, I am going to be aware of them, guys. I don't think this piece is going to last long. But while it lasts, I, I do need to try and make it last. So we're just going to move back onto the border here. So we're in rel relatively close to those, th those horse pastures. I've got my two other armies down the other end, which should be able to hold off most things in those territories, because they're good defensible settlements I've got there, and they've got to advance at me through the mountains. Let's make more friends there. Boys to strike. No. Remain pure at ease. Spill your lies quickly so we can finish. I, I suspect way is not going to last long. Remain honest. Ready yourselves. On the march. You're, no, you're, you're also going to pull down here. Through their territory. Um, because if they come up here, I'll have time to build an army, to be fair. I do love anding. Anding makes us so much money. See, what is the benefit? Right, let's have a look. So we get 50 income from peasantries. He's not huge. And we get an extra building. That's the real benefit for that. So that's worth us doing there because we'll get an extra production building. And Anding is making us a lot of money. Chang'an, I actually want to keep building. And we need various buildings. But the big one is going to be always getting defences built up here. Jade Mine actually has a fairly beefy defence straight away. is really up his satisfaction. That ups his satisfaction a little bit. Uh, let's look through the court thing. Can I give him a pay rise now? No, because I've spent all my money already. Next turn, we'll do that at the start. Bring me. Bring you in my absence. For now, it's just slowly repositioning ourselves. Don't trust any of these guys. I would have liked to have kept the hold of that trade port, but, uh, well, I should have pieced out the turn before, basically. Um, I did also derp. I should have taken that other, um... Oh, yay. Destiny awaits. Warriors, attend. Towards 
You're going to stay there because I can head there. We've still got two here. We can throw up another one relatively quickly. Hmm. Reducing recruitment cost is always good. Mustering turns. What does mustering mean? It, the quicker a unit, so after it's been rebuilt, the quicker it comes back. I do want to push to that, which means I've got to go through there. So mustering is effectively similar to replenishment speed. It's when I first recruit a unit, the, the quicker it becomes effective, so... Really? I was gonna say. There we go. Request. Oh, nice. I didn't realize you could request money from your people. My so this is my. Your wish and I is that my air? No, that's not my air. My air is over here. I wish my air had a special I feel refreshed and holy. picture. Oh, he is not happy in that army. But he can deal with it. Summon the merchants. I would browse their goods. So Sufang, uh, one, one, two, three, four, five. So I can level that up to get another building. Um, but I'm gonna level that up to start with. Ah, oh, shame I can't get any of the others, but why well, say that? Um, I do have some silk now, actually, so, yeah. There we go. Oh, Chang'an. Let's look at Chang'an. Straight up leveling that up. Though this place is going to be leveled up, is going to be fantastic because of that jade mine as well. To get some military infrastructure there, please, as well. The floor is open. No, oh, but it wouldn't be that far off. Speak quickly. I would rather this was over. What do you want? Hmm. So I'm gaining much more from that. Uh, they are a vassal, so it's not necessarily good. But it's giving us a nice chunk of income. A reasonable but I'm going to do a lot of these simply because they are going to still get everybody more friendly with us, which helps us long run. Oh, it is you. So they're going to make a lot more of that. I'm, I'm going to do it simply because I want the, I need the money at the moment, guys. These are great, but I'm also going to support both these guys' independence. Because we can theoretically go to war now, especially if somebody else were to be on the war, in the war. You like them. 
We approve this. Oops. Well, I was going to do that anyway. I meant to be doing trade agreement, though. Let's get this over with quickly. Oh God, no! We're not doing that, though. Spill your lies yeah, yeah, yeah. quickly, no. so we can finish. Make it quick. There we, we go. So. We're supporting their independence, which means if they break off, I've basically vowed to go to war with them, guys, um, to help them. Oh wow, everybody will. Um... What do you want? God no. Spill your lies quickly, so we can. No, and I'm not willing to pay that. But no, hopefully we'll manage to split some people off, which would help us. Uh, where are you? You're right up here. Right, we're gonna end turn. But now, they all definitely used to appear grey if you couldn't get them, uh, rather than just having a lock symbol next to them, which I far preferred. I'm not quite sure why that's changed or if it's a bug. Um, it just feels a little weird, as does the fact I'm looking at some forest. The yellow turbans are sailing about, so long as they're not at war with me, I don't care. They actually quite like me because I've been at war so much with everybody else, so... Oh wow, Kingdom of Wei now has a regency. Why must we speak? Why must we speak? Let's have a look at what current coalitions are still about, guys, because I'm not a fan of my current coalition. Um, because we're just too weak. Let us get this over with. And I'm going to leave them for now. Basically, when they eventually disintegrate, I will probably drop. Well, I will, will try and get into the other one. But that's not going to be for a bit. Mm. I'm going to try and get him a higher position if I can. Who's happiest here? You. No, that, that'll hold him for now. But wait, he has a faction grudge against me as well. Oh, so maybe I should just strip his stuff and get rid of him. For now, we're also going to strip his stuff because I suspect... I'm not going to keep him long run. Yeah, so he's, he's from the faction I confederated, so he's just never going to be happy under our rule. Um, and in fact, maybe let's just fire him after giving him pay rise. So we did gain quite a few characters, which is quite nice, actually. But some of them are, are inevitably going to uh, have the odd issue with us. Zangba, he is really good. Get the instinct buff. Have a nice horse for extra resolve. Really shiny army there. Armor there. 
That is really good. I'm going to go for the debuff because that is really good. I've not used these guys enough. Um, so... Right, let us get some assignments going. So here makes its money from commerce and industry. That's very good. Okay, let's look at our next province. Which makes all of this money from commerce and industry. There we go. It's Shen Yu can go here. And is a mix. So actually, that's not good, bad there. There we go. That's all of our assignments done. Private workshops. Oh, we've already got private workshops. Oh, did I already have both? I didn't even realise her. Huh? Wow, we get minus 25 food, and it's still one of my biggest food producers. Um... I guess labor is probably one of our best. Because long run that'll help, we'll be able to push it up in other places. One, two, three, four, five. So yeah, there going up is worth it. God damn it, I should have leveled there up again. Grab a private workshop there to make other buildings cheaper. We're going to keep trespassing through their territory. So, guys, this has been a very not much happening um, session. But we do have not much happening sessions, you know. We've just gained Take peace. Ah. We will do this. Laugh now. I did say I didn't think it was going to last long. However, we are just at war with Shu Han at the moment, so. There are worse things which could have happened. Um, we're going to move these two armies up this way, and down, we're going to move down here. Uh, and bring everybody back in. And obviously we're going to have to re-recruit our other armies. We're going to recruit an army here as well. Because this is the main point of contact, guys. Ready yourselves. Bring me a report on my holdings. Prepare my chambers. Announce my arrival. Marching. Remain firm. For the <clears throat> Bend. Do not break. Trust instinct! Ah, oh, damn it. A lot of my good people are currently busy. My aim is precise. You two there should be able to hold. Um, I'd really like to get somebody like him, but he is currently on.
I just can't afford to, so we'll get him next turn. We're going to go to war with these guys again, because we're going to be dragged into war. These, these guys are going to inevitably be dragged into war, and they only got two territories. For the people. And they're nice and easy to capture. Uh, we'll capture their territories very quickly Our here. Was rewarded. And silk income is good. We will bring righteousness to this settlement. Home gladdens the heart. You beckon? We keep pushing down to this one. Yeah, we are obviously a wall there, but I'm not that worried. Uh, there. Honor your ideals. I, I'd have preferred a few more turns of peace. Maybe I shouldn't have ever dropped my armies. I should have just, you know, because we, we should have realized they were going to come back at us, but... Then again, there's lots of other people at war with Shu as well, so uh, that army worries me. Agent of order with us. Oh. <sighs> no. If you wish it. We are uh, don't need to be at war with them yet. Um, okay, that's fine. We should have replenished by the time they get anywhere near us. That's kind of concerning, but not too worrying. Um, we may need to fall back a bit here. That said. It's only going to be so long before Shu is having humongous food issues again, so. Lead strongly. Never yield. Marching. Purge chaos. Unification requires discipline. Never yield. Mm, do we push up there or do we just charge over here? You know what? We're just going to push. We're going to push. Try this. and push here anyway. On the march. On the march. Chef Fury. Crush them. Decisive victory there. This guy is going to be held a bit more defensively From now. Uh, let him build up a bit. But that was a nice, good, solid hit for us. We've taken all of their territory Only very quickly. Will the word be uh, spread. We control all of the horse pastures because I just got the achievement Naysayer, which is literally control all the horse resources. I am at your disposal, my lord. I cannot. I must stoop low to hear your muttering. I thought I'd already supported their independence. Um, Why must we speak? Really? They'd already potentially accept peace. I'm just intrigued if I can force it with food again. Yes. Oh my god, not just force it, I can make them pay me. Oh my god, hang on, hang on, hang on. Ah, oh, almost. They are that low on food, guys, that basically they're declaring war on me. I can forcibly grab a territory off them. Almost forcibly grab a territory off them. Um, I'm not planning on doing this just yet. I'm just intrigued that they're that, they're, they're that weak. Um, I 
So yeah, a few turns and we should be able to get peace relatively easily. Very nice army just thrown together there. I want to give it another turn before we do advance. Uh, we're going to push down. We're going to need to move up that way to deal with that. Keep an eye on them. That'll do for now. Income, I'm, I'm trying not to overspend because income is, ah, there you go. They've got some reinforcements coming. Ooh, they actually hit me. Um, I'm gonna retreat at the moment and I'm gonna be fighting them on my own. So we're potentially gonna have a big battle there. Um, I should have kept the other guys going up the river rather than landing them because we could have got them there quite easily. Uh, they've still got, those armies are all there from, but why are they falling back? That feels foolish. We're going to move in there. That's not worrying. That army's just taking attrition. It can't ever regain any capacity. We're going to hit them and start moving that army quickly, then start moving that army down. There's also going to be a lot of... Uh, what you'll also see is a lot of... Um... To arms. With honour. To arms. Yeah, no, 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 starve out. We're Strike not going to hit there until we go to your army. You're going to see a lot of um, yellow turbans popping up behind the lines for sure. This is a nice place because it's got Authority good defensive potential as well. It will prosper for the better under my rule. Snow's purity hides Rejoice. many sins, your Lord has returned. but they still mm. exist. Be ready to spring. Oh my god, you can probably hear the rain outside my place now. That is... It's, it's, it's a little bit of heavy rain outside where I am, as you might be able to hear. Wow. Just rejigging my, uh, my main guy's army a little bit here. Um, I would like some more pearl dragons in there, but I don't really want to swap them. Then again, they're not as useful. They're not really useful in either of these. There's good getting buffs from either of these guys, so. Uh, I am loving all of these units, these dragons, guys. Uh, Pearl dragons do seem a little bit better than Azor dragons, uh, basically because they're, they're not... Azor dragons are obviously anti-cav, pearl dragons are anti-infantry, these guys are... Assault. Uh, yeah, all-rounder, uh, assault, blocks melee attacks, missile defense, good range toughness, good melee toughness. 53 melee, uh, 59 melee pass. These guys are technically slightly better in melee, melee toughness is... But they don't have the same melee toughness, so um, they also have a they also shoot, which makes them a very good versatile multiple use unit. Um, and these guys are great to stick in front and just soak all the arrows. I'm gonna leave it like that for now. We're gonna sit there in ambush formation. Might not actually take it. We have made ourselves heard. Yet. Sack and withdraw the infamy all. buff. The crowds are small, but there are people. Uh, we will recap it next soon, but I'm gonna pull back into our own ter well, into friendly territory Always for replenishment. Fall. 
And this is where we are going to have to leave this one, guys. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you are enjoying this. Please feel free to pop any comments in the comment section or jump over to my Discord and say hi. There is a link to my Discord in the comments and the description, as well as links to my Twitter, my Patreon, and my affiliations with Overclockers and Humble Bundle Games. So, please check them out. As always, thank you very much for your time.